Good day, welcome to Vaughn TV. I'm Michael G. Blaney Tadabos. Today we got a special guest. Before I introduce you, Eric, um, a lot of feedback. People are saying I'm using a lot of my hands and that these segments are a little too long. Um, the hands, I can't promise that I'll work on. Uh, that's because that's how I talk. Um, however, we're going to try to make the segment a little shorter today and see the feedback we get. So I'm aiming for like six minutes, okay? Try our best. The last one was like 13 minutes. Um, so we got Eric from RepTech here, the official rep for Lutron. Now Lutron is one of the leading lighting control companies in the world. That's right. Bold statement. I'm going to say another bold statement. Ready? All right. Straight from Lutron's uh, website and actually on this billboard, on this uh, display. display here. If every U.S. household installed one Lutron dimmer, we would reduce CO2 emissions equivalent to 370,000 cars. That's okay, true. bold statement. I'm going to let you carry that now. All right. Well, essentially, that's basically referring to the fact that dimmers save energy. And when you dim, you save energy. And when you dim more, you save even more. And you elongate the life of your bulbs, your lamps. Exactly. Mm -hmm. You're actually exponentially increasing the lamp life, which arguably is more of an environmental benefit than the energy savings alone because now there's less, less relamping, manufacturing of lamps, and even uh, the uh, energy consumed to produce those lamps yeah. to, to begin with. So it, it's, it's technically it's, dimmers are it's the green huge. thing to do, Yeah. right? And, and you're also accomplishing, sorry to interrupt there, but you're also accomplishing one of the most important part in, parts of lighting is creating that ambience in a room, setting that mood, right? Because you, you don't want to walk into your living room or your bedroom with that 100% you know, light level, right? You want to set that, that tone, that mood. Uh, dimmers are one of the very few products on the market that actually not only have a green contribution, but al actually also make your space a better place. Okay, and, the, I, and actually, one fact, um, Lutron actually invented the dimmer. Yes, by Joel, Joel Spira. Joel Spira. So if he's, and he's actually still running the company till this day. Yeah, he's alive and uh, well running the company. It's, so if uh, he's it's watching, impressive. just uh, say hi there. Eric, doing an awesome job. Um, the last episode we left off, and I mentioned you know, how LED and compact fluorescence are, um, are the wave of the future, but it was still early. But regardless, people are still asking, people are still buying this stuff, and there's nothing wrong with it. It's just it's a little high in the price point for, you know, in terms of the value you're getting. But having said that, people still want it. Lutron now launched the C.L L dimmer that you can actually dim now, your CFL and your LEDs. Yes, but okay. to be clear, it is, it, they do still have to be dimmable CFL mm -hmm. and dimmable LEDs. LEDs. We're not talking about standard CFLs. Mm -hmm. We must have dimmable CFL. So if you got a dimmable CFL LED, you can now buy the C.L dimmer. dimmer. Okay, now just to explain a little about it. Okay, so the C.L dimmer is essentially your standard dimmer. It's a regular incandescent line voltage dimmer but with the added ability to control reliably the dimmable CFL and dimmable LED lamps on the market. There's some additional circuitry in there called HED technology, mm -hmm. and that technology prevents things like the flickering, the dropout, the sudden shutting off of the lamp when you turn on the hair dryer, and it allows you so that in the case of a three-way, if we had our lights set for a very low level like that, mm -hmm you shut it off, then at the other end, you were to go turn it on, a standard dimmer may not actually turn that lamp on because the slider would have to be first risen to the top mm -hmm. and then dimmed back down. So you could dim compact fluorescent LEDs, incandescent, just a general incandescent bulb. That's <clears> correct. <throat> and, or halogen lamp. And low voltage? Not for low voltage. So not for low voltage. So it'll the do everything key. besides low voltage. Yeah, okay. but the key <clears> here is that it's the world's first dimmer that actually supports this mixed load type. Mm -hmm. So you can have LED and compact first on the same load. At the same time, hook up the, the same dimmer. Install a dimmer by a qualified electrician, and you can simply... That's right. So you could start off with your regular halogen lamps mm -hmm. today, and then one at a time replace them with CFL or LED. And it'll work in sync with this dimmer. That's right. Awesome. Okay, next product we got here. A lot of sex appeal to this. This is the Verity by Lutron. That's right. Okay. A statement. Exactly. So basically, you're still dimming, right? But now you're making a statement. So you're, you're going green. But you're making that statement that you can simply slide your finger up and down and yes. dim. That's right. Okay. This is essentially the Star Trek or iPod of dimmers. You know, at the end of the day, it is a dimmer. It's a spec grade dimmer. So its typical applications are going to be something like uh, museums, high-end restaurants, high-end retail. Or a homeowner that wants to make a statement. Yeah, yeah. you want to claim your, su somewhere, anywhere you want to claim supremacy. Mm -hmm. You can interchange these, uh, these LED inserts. So if you want to go, I think the colors were blue, green, red, and white, right? Uh, so you simply no red. just, red? Green, no, uh, no red. white, okay. green, and blue. So you simply just interchange them, click it in. That's right. 
Now this one's a blue one, I, I think, okay. as well. But um, Which one's, <laughs> just to show them the different colors. Here, let's go with this one here, green. Mm -hmm. And simply pop it it's in. It's hot swappable. You don't have to take the dimmer off the wall to do this. So if you ever want to switch it up two years from now, yeah. you simply just order the insert, whatever color you want. Exactly. And, and then that's suddenly the green one. now you have a Halloween theme. And you can see how colors greatly affect yeah. the, uh, the look and feel of the product or even of the space. You awesome. Know, our products, I mean, uh, here's just one example, but a lot of our products come in over 27 different colors. Well, these are the Saturn series, right? Which, yeah. will be, which will be featured on our website and Lutron.com where you can see 27 different Saturn colors. That's so right. you don't just have to go, can we just show that old fashioned wall plate? Yeah, for sure. Okay, a standard wall plate, I right? Mean, you put that over top of a Compared to a, a screwless. Regular, yeah. yeah, right, so put it there, right? So you can see the difference, right? This is a more of a custom home design type of Exactly. Screwless addition. wall plates, engineered plastics that resist sunlight, and uh, what you've yeah. got is just a very nice, clean So you go upgrade to screwless plates, and if you want to go one step further, we upgrade got... Upgrade to satin colors. Yeah, you got 27 yeah. satin colors, so for instance, you want to go brown, exactly. you know, you got brown there. You know, rather than having a, a, wall, a, a wall wart or something like acne on the wall, mm -hmm. you know, you can now have a wall accent, something yeah. to be proud of on the wall. Last product, we're, yes. we're at seven minutes, we're doing good on time, we're gonna wrap it up soon. Last product, let's talk about the Maestro and the power save device. Exactly, so the Maestro Wireless is uh, essentially another smart dimmer, mm -hmm. very much like this. You know, you turn on and off, it has a customizable fade rates, uh, you can press and hold to create a timeout delay, So a time, the time to get to bed. Exactly, right? And then so, the light shuts off once something. So it fades out slowly. So you could do your thing, get ready, and as the light's slowly fading, you, you know, it. It, it times. Yeah. Okay, awesome. That's the Maestro. Okay. Exactly. This was the Skylark. This is just a basic dimmer. You're okay. Right. Retails for about $20. Uh, the Maestro, a line voltage, retails for about $35. Mm -hmm. Okay. The Verity is about $150 retail. Right. Okay, and this fluorescent dimmer, just so people know, I think it was about 45 to 50 bucks. That sounds about right. Yeah. It's, uh, it's around the same price point as a standard Diva dimmer. Yeah. Last, last item there, we got the power save device. Right, so essentially what we're doing here is we've got uh, a Maestro dimmer, and if instead of buying a standard Maestro, mm -hmm. we can buy what's called a Maestro wireless. It's physically the same installation as a Maestro dimmer, but it has an, a, an RF radio that allows us to remotely control it. So it, it only listens for a signal, and we can send a signal to it through something called, say, a Pico. Yeah. And this Pico d controller is essentially a, a product that you can mount to the side of a bed. You could put it uh, it's wireless. on a wheelchair. Yeah, it's mm -hmm. wireless. I can use it as a handheld car visor. So by clicking this, it's physically like having someone turn on the dimmer within 30 feet. Yeah. Right. So let's even say you put on your car visor, right? You come home. Right, you want to turn on the lights outside, you know, for safety, convenience, you turn it on, and wirelessly it'll tell this to go on and your lights come on outside. Exactly. And okay. you could even, because it's the exact size of a Decora opening, you could literally... Like a virtual three-way without wiring. Exactly. You literally just stick it on or screw it to the wall. You're right. Right? You're right. And you put a screwless, preferably not that plate, uh, preferably you put a screwless plate. It looks plate. much better with yeah. the screwless, of course. And you have a virtual three-way, so you can control yeah. your lights from two different locations without That's running right. the addition of wires. I can get one of those or two or three. Last one, the power save. Yes, the power saver. Mm -hmm. Think of it a lot like this Pico. It's almost the same thing, except instead of actually manually pushing the buttons, the sensor is automatically going to trigger the lights for me. Mm -hmm. Application, so, where would you put that? I think some great applications for this would be uh, kids' rooms. How mm -hmm. many times do you tell your kids, turn off the light, turn off the light? The sensor now turns off the light for you. I think you have experience in that. <laughs> <laughs> So awesome stuff. So basically you walk into a room, the light will automatically go on. If you want. Well, if you have a vacancy. If you have it set in vacancy mm -hmm. mode, which I think is actually better residentially speaking. Mm -hmm. So you have to physically turn on the light. That's right. And then once you leave the room, it'll time Sensor, out and time the light out. will shut off. Yeah. Awesome stuff. Uh, we're going to link it up, Lutron.com. Uh, how are we doing on time? 10 minutes. Eric, thanks for coming. All right. Um, thanks so much for having me. Episode number seven. Um, I'm Michael G. Benetatibus, introducing you to the green world of electrical distributors.